The Toronto Argonauts are six and a half point underdogs when they visit the Montreal Alouettes on Thursday night. The Owls won the recent matchup between the two teams in week four when Caleb Evans hit Cole Speaker for a 44-yard touchdown on a surprise third down bomb and are looking to improve to 6-0 and for the first time since 2006. Meanwhile, the Argos are coming off a disappointing loss in Saskatchewan during which Cameron Dukes threw four interceptions. Ouch. To make matters worse, the former CFL All-Star defensive lineman Jake Serezna will not play in this game due to a shoulder injury. JC, can Toronto hand Montreal their first loss of the season or at least cover what is a relatively widespread? Look, Toronto had a formula for victory to start the year. That's how they upset BC. That's how they got off to a 2-0 start. It was Cameron Dukes not turning over the football and being efficient with it and a strong defensive line getting after the passer. Well, Cameron Dukes has thrown five interceptions in the last two weeks, and they no longer have two all-stars on that defensive line in Falar and Aro Malade and Jake Serezna. It was a commanding victory by the Montreal Alouettes the last time these two teams played two weeks ago now. It's going to be an even Bigger victory for Montreal this time around. I'm taking them to cover all these points. I think the Argos are in a little bit of a spiral until they can get healthy on the defensive side of the ball. I don't think they've got the horses right now to get it done against a top team like Montreal. I'm taking the Alouettes to win, certainly, and and largely for the reasons you stated. I think Toronto's defensive line was the best in the CFL coming into this year. But between the release of Sean Oakman and the injuries that have riddled, especially the edge rushers that they've got, I don't know how this unit is supposed to perform at a high level. So I am taking the Alouettes to win. However, I am going to take the Argos to cover in this one, specifically because the Alouettes are on a short week, right? It is tough to overcome that in the CFL. Granted, the Alouettes were at home last week. They're at home again. But playing with just one practice, Marc-Antoine Decois, a game-time decision, the all-star safety for the Alouettes, that could be an issue. And I also think that the Argos have upgraded this receiving core. They have very talented Canadian receivers, but they're almost all in the six-game injured list. Guys like Kevin Mattel have not played. Deshaun Brissett has not played. So they are going to four American receivers in this one with Tommy Neal hitting the six-game injured list. I think that might make the options for Cameron Dukes a little bit better. Maybe they can catch the Alouettes a little bit off guard with this short week. But again, I, I don't think they get the job done in terms of a win. I will pick them to cover the, the relatively widespread.